Hey everybody, Ben with Classic Firearms here. Today is Wednesday, January the 25th, and we just got a new small lot of Swiss straight pull rifles in, particularly K11s and K31s, and we're going to show you a few of them here today. One of the things that people say they like best about our videos is that you see it as we see it. In other words, we don't stage particular guns. We simply take unopened boxes or unopened crates, we pop the top on it, lay it out, and you see it when we see it. We may pull out the ugliest rifle in this batch, we may pull out the best one, but typically out of five or six, you get a good representation of what we have. Now what we have here, Jordan, if you'll come on in, and let me find the tag on this box. We have, this is the K31, we also have K11s. This is the G code, these were imported by Century Arms. They did the grading. The G indicates good, Sometimes uh, we will purchase them and they have a GC code, which means they have found minor cracks in the stock under the C code. This is the G code, which means that upon their initial inspection, they did not find any cracks in the stock. However, let me warn you, cracks in the stocks on K31 rifles and K11 Swiss rifles in general are very common. So we're not going to guarantee there's no cracks in these stocks. But on initial inspection, Century is saying they did not find cracks in these as a rule. But read Brutus' description. We tell you more about that there. Uh, Austin's going to help me with this video. We've got some unopened cases here. This is a master pack of five. The first K11 is on the table. Austin, go ahead and start breaking those out and just lay them on the table there. Oh, I should have got a knife. I could be doing this with you, but I didn't. We'll go to the K11 while you're breaking this out. Here's our initial sample of K11. You guys all know about the 1911 short rifles. This particular one has a sling. This one has a muzzle, uh, a muzzle cover. Some do, some don't. As our descriptions say, uh, we don't guarantee it for it. That's a beautiful stock on that one. You'll see as they come out, condition of the stocks vary. This one's really nice. Austin, just get them out and up here. You hand that to me. Again, with this K11, maybe we've lucked into a nice box. I don't represent all of them this way. This would certainly be a hand select rifle. Beautiful bluing. Here's another one. Muzzle cap. Rifle came with a sling. So far, four out of five of these have had the slings. Really nice blue. And what's that last one look like, Austin? We'll take it over here. Oops. Go ahead and work around to the K31s. We can be bringing those out while we highlight this one. Certainly this one box, and those were unopened folks. We didn't know what we were gonna get. But this one box, very nice. Swiss rifles. We are calling these good condition. We try not to overemphasize them, and certainly Century called them good condition. Everything I'm seeing in this box, to me, we classify as good, good plus. All right, you saw our first K31. It did not have a sling. This one does. Show you the Swiss uh, emblem on it here. Let me show you the other side. Got some really nice grain in that stock. There's some type of debris there that will probably clean up. Yeah, it's coming off of my fingernail. This one's more of a light beechwood stock. Again, we have the sling. Good bluing on this one. Typically, I see more bluing wear on these guns than this. But so far, this has been a good group. Let's see, was this one the next one? I believe it is. As we say in our ads, some will have slings, some will not. Some will have muzzle caps, some will not. This K31 does not have a sling. It will come just like it is, but nice bluing. Certainly a nice beech wood stock. And at first glance, I haven't seen a crack in any of these either. That's not to say there won't be once again though. Austin, thank you for your help. I appreciate you going about your business. We'll close it out. Was this the last one? It was. I don't think I've seen that one. Very pretty walnut finish on that particular K31. Folks, if these five uh, 
five boxes from each individual master pack or any indication. This is a good looking group of Swiss rifles. Certainly everything we've seen has been surplus good condition. We've got them on the site now. Good surplus is getting hard to find. So if you want one of these, jump on it. They're going out on the e-blast today. They'll be in the video and they're up on the site now for sale. We appreciate your business. And as always, thank you for joining us at www.classicfirearms.com.